maxillary artery, first part is called mandibular, has the anterior auricular, deep tympanic, inferior alveolar, the middle meningeal and accessory meningeal branches. So five in total. The branches mentioned here just for inclusion from the middle meningeal. Going back to label the middle meningeal here. Then the axis or meningeal. Then we have the second part of the maxillary artery called the pterygoid. From here we also have five branches. Masteric, buccal, lateral pterygoid, anterior and posterior deep temporal. Third part is called pterygopalatine. And it also has branches such as the infraorbital artery, anterior superior alveolar artery, posterior superior alveolar artery, the descending palatine, from here we get the greater palatine and the lesser palatine. The vedian also is there, and the pharyngeal. Remember, mandibular part, number one. Number two is pterygoid part, and number three is the pterygopalatine part.